Hello everybody and welcome to a video that's hopefully going to be a lot of fun. Today I'm sitting here on Discord with three of the judges for this season's BattleBots Reborn Cup. They are Dom the Seaborg, Rich or BattleBots Boy, and Baxter or Captain Mantine. Say hello everybody. Hi. I have hello. downgraded from a lemonade to a juice. <laughs> Just a juice now? What happened? Uh, I've lost all my energy. I, I still have fun. a lot of caffeine. That, that's good. Did you receive it from an unknown sponsor? Um, not yet, no. <laughs> I just realized typing... that I had my microphone turned off. Uh -oh. God damn it. <laughs> you were typing it all codes. That's what you were doing, mate. Oh, bother. <laughs> oh, hang on. There's I mean, coffee in the background. I hope yeah. you can <laughs> just realized I muted Baxter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <Baxter. laughs> my god. <laughs> <laughs> no one looking in. All right, let's all let's all check and make sure no one's muted. So today we are here for the BattleBots Reborn Hunger Games. I've got this idea from Jim Jamatic, who took a bunch of podcasters in the robot combat field, put them in the Hunger Games simulator online. Today we're going to do that to promote BattleBots Reborn Cup Season Five. We took 24 of the 111 bots. We chose them through random picker. Now they're going to fight to the death in a different way. I know it took us a f***ing hour to pick the robots, so you better f***ing appreciate this. Here we are to read off the teams for the totally accurate S5 Simulato, because I ran out of characters. Simulato. Simulato. Isn't that Spanish for something? Maybe. I don't know. Maybe it's a conjugate. Oh, let me check. Hey Siri, what is Simulato in Spanish? Simulator. Oh. Alright, it works. <laughs> okay, then. Here we go, reading off the teams. From District 1, we have Bite Force and Blacksmith. From District 2, we have Overdrive and Monsoon. Let me do the scream. Let me do the scream. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> that close enough? Sounds like you're trying to squeeze a turd out. From District 3, we have Bronco and Axe Backwards. From District 4, Tantrum and Sub-Zero. The robots we hope don't do well, but are probably going to do well anyways. <laughs> Here's the ultimate dream team from District 5. It's Killer B and Gollum. Yes. The ultimate <laughs> dream team. <laughs> from District 6, we have Kilohertz and Hydra. From District 7, it's I-Beam and Wipeout. So what you do after you, do, you take your I-Beam is then you wipe it all out, right? Oh my god. This is uh, an unfiltered, uncensored dom, everybody. Get used to it. Yeah. yeah, go fuck yourself. I don't have a sensor by in front of me, so you, you can't just, you can't bleep me out now, fucker. Oh. Wait, that's too many. Kappa, Kappa, Kappa's gonna get us. Cunt. <laughs> just that whole thing is just a long ass beep. <laughs> no, no, technical difficulties. Please stand by. Right. From, what did I get myself into? Yeah. <laughs> from District 8, Bombshell and Biohazard. From District 9, Sawblaze and Double Jeopardy. Robot which I had high expectations for, and then it got paired with Double Jeopardy. Yeah. And when you hear the cannon shots at the end of a day to signal who's died, it's Double Jeopardy. Here's the thing, he's only got two rounds, so <laughs> once he fires two shots, he's already lost. After the first two tributes are dead, we don't know what's happening. That's the thing with Double Jeopardy, he's carrying... He's carrying live ammunition into the fucking starting box. And he's still gonna run from the cornucopia at the start. From District 10, it's Brutus and Gruff. From District 11, it's Minotaur and Hexadecimator. Dream team right here. The Robo Games dream team. Robo Games dream oh, team. Yeah. We got his attention now. Someone said Robo Games. Where? Huh? Where? Where? Give me the content. <laughs> <laughs> and finally, District 12, Lucky and Lockjaw. But didn't they actually face off in a Desperado final in like 2018? Oh yeah, you're right. Prediction is, hear me out here, okay. Okay. okay? I think, by some sheer fucking coincidence, okay, mm -hmm. Lucky's gonna win. I've said that, he's gonna be the first one to go now, isn't he? He might. <laughs> I'm gonna put my money on Killer B. I have a feeling that the yellow boy is gonna win. Hmm, decisions, decisions, decisions. Hmm. <sighs> time he makes a decision, we'll actually be finished. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. So we have a Hello Matty Hello. Matt's joining? Yes. Thank you. Presentation. I've only got one robot. I feel like half the fucking field. <laughs> yeah, don't worry, don't worry. I have zero robots. We're all good. Is that true? Zero robots originally. Who gives a crap? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. We have no Cell, no Tombstone, no Yeti. Um, what other big <laughs> names? No Witch Doctor. 
Yeah, yeah, where's my witch doctor, man? Come on. <laughs> no, Nightmare, so many big names, and this is supposed to be no a prediction. Warhead. <laughs> no Warhead. A Razor of all fucking robots. You'd expect Razor to be in it. <laughs> yeah, <f> Razor. <laughs> oh. Meanwhile, <laughs> I'm gonna go with Nick and say Killer B as well. Fair enough. Okay, so we've got two Killer Bs, we've got one Lucky, Matiator. Who are you gonna pick? I'm picking Wipeout, because Wipeout's my bot, and my bot's always... Oh, <laughs> and, all right. Okay, and Bax. Yep. Thank you for your opinion. Right, let's move on. <laughs> <laughs> I only knew that was something I already gave up before he said anything. So. <laughs> yeah, you couldn't even attempt. Go on. Steve. Go on, Steve. You only, you only hey, like, why even try? Right, right, Tito's butt is, only Tito's butt is like, making an appearance in my video. The only real butt here that I care anything about is Biohazard, so go Biohazard. All right. Okay, so there we go. So we've got two Killer Bees, we've got one Lucky, we've got a Biohazard, and we've got a Wipeout. That's a good selection. Tito. And that, means, gonna and that means the Truman is going to be fucking Tantrum. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be Gro. No, 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 it's going to be Gollum. Just watch. Gollum's going to steal the show. Oh, God, is everyone 13 years or older? Max, you might be close. No, I'm 15. We're good. We're good. <laughs> okay. Whew. That could have been close. Yeah, we have to be careful. Here we go. As the tributes stand on their podiums, the horn sounds. Sawblaze runs into the cornucopia and hides. Gollum runs away from the cornucopia. <laughs> Double Jeopardy and Biohazard fight for a bag. Double Jeopardy gives up and retreats. Yeah. Not anyway, who gives a shit? <laughs> Good job, Biohazard. Scare him off. <laughs> Sub Zero rips a mace yeah. out of Bronco's hands. Wow. I'm a superior flipper, bitch. <laughs> Tito meows in the background, upset with what's happening. <laughs> <laughs> Nick's gonna tend to his pussy again. Oh, God. <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> Are you trying to get us on Pornhub? Because it's fucking succeeding. <laughs> <laughs> this is becoming quite a fucking occurrence, isn't it? Monsoon runs away from the cornucopia. Hexy D runs away from the cornucopia. Overdrive runs away from the cornucopia. Hold on, do we know what, what we're being in? Is this like, does this have like a lot of water, a lot of desert, a lot of jungle? Like, do we know what arena it's set in? Is it set in the battle box? Is that it? Let's say it's just the entire warehouse. So, like, the cornucopia is the battle box, and then the pits are just, like, wooden uh, forest areas. Kilohertz takes a handful of throwing knives. We're all knives. just running for the pits, basically. Yeah, basically. <laughs> oh, no, why does Kilohertz need knives? First of all, he's got an axe, and second of all, he's made of polycarb, and most of the way, what's made out of fucking hard ops. What are they gonna do? What are the knives gonna do? Don't underestimate I mean, his side like, like a Kilohertz arm. strategy, honestly. The arm to throw them. The more the merrier, because he's probably going to miss a few times. Hold on, Killer Hurts takes a handful. Where is his fucking hand? Shouldn't it be Tantrum taking the fucking knife? <laughs> no one said this was going to be fully accurate. His bow was reborn ever accurate, come on. It's true. Right? I-Beam wins the tournament, guys. Fight Force grabs a shield leaning on the cornucopia. Wipeout snatches a pair of sides. I forgot how to pronounce this already. Size. Paint tool size. There we go. It's my drawing software. It's why I used to draw all you wonderful, wonderful people. <laughs> Subscribe to down below. Yes, by the way, I'm doing commissions now. Take it. Take it like a whore. I don't take commissions, but I am more active than Dom. It's true, but his content is shit. <laughs> no. I mean... Uh, <laughs> and whilst, we're doing, whilst we're doing a domestic, Nick, continue. Minotaur runs away from the cornucopia. Little bitch. Brutus grabs a pack, a backpack and retreats. It said it wasn't empty. Yeah, apparently it's got something in it. Maybe his hopes and dreams. Lucky gathers as much food as he can. I-Beam runs away from the cornucopia. Coward. Yeah. Hydra and Lockjaw fight for a bag. Hydra gives up and retreats. Well, we will Hydra. talk here. Could Lockjaw theoretically beat Hydra? Discuss. Mm -hmm. Definitely. I think he could. I mean, yeah, given how easily Minotaur beat Hydra, I'd say... Yeah, I'd say, say Lockjaw could beat Hydra. I can see it. Well, there we have it. It is accurate. Gruff and Bombshell fight for a bag. Bombshell gives up and retreats. That Question for you all. Gruff versus Bombshell. Discuss. Oh. <laughs> Given that Bombshell won only one of his last nine fights, I'd say it's a fair, a fairly accurate... Gruff's got him. But it beat him. Yeah, but yeah. it beat him yeah. soon. It beat Tombstone. Gruff didn't beat Tombstone, but Bombshell oh, did. Oh. That means technically Bombshell is technically better than Gruff. <laughs> yeah, and Chomp beat Bite Force, so therefore Chomp is the champion of three straight seasons. Yeah, it is. Yeah. It? Chomp wins. <laughs> <laughs> when in doubt, Chomp is the best. Blacksmith finds a bag of explosives. 
Oh, these are in the worst hands of like the possible. first season. That is the worst thing that could have possibly happened. <laughs> yes, let's give these bombs to a fucking pyromaniac. I wonder what could go wrong. Killer B grabs a jar of fishing bait while Axe backwards gets fishing gear. They're not even on the same team. I hope they're not doing that together. Bromance is the bromance. Oh no! Tantro cannot handle the circumstances <laughs> and commit suicide! Oh my god. What? <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. He straight says screw this! I don't think it. Boys, I don't think Tantrum is going to win. <laughs> oh my god. To be fair, this is about an average Tantrum fight for you. Yeah, I was going to say. <laughs> Play the uh, Price is Right losing horn right here. Oh, now we got action. Killer B ambushes Sub-Zero and kills him. Killer B, my man! Death to Wedge. Let me just hold on, guys. That man's just taking his life. We're just gonna continue like nothing's happened. Yes, because there's gonna be 22 more deaths. XCD, Bite Force, Blacksmith, Lockjaw, and Grof hunt for other tributes. And Goblin dies from an infection. Oh, it, it, le it just <laughs> ran away and then died. <laughs> he ran away and like, pretty, uh, That's pretty amazing. He didn't even eat any toxic berries or anything. He just fell over. Sawblaze discovers a cave. Brutus attempts to climb a tree but falls on biohazard, killing them both. <laughs> oh, How does that happen? What, what a way to go. Barely impressive. Here's the thing we've got to take into consideration, okay? With Brutus' gyroscopic spinner, he probably lands on top of Biohazard, and because Biohazard is so thin, he catches fire, and his armor is broken. I can see it. Two predictions have gone already. Yeah. <laughs> Lucky, X backwards in overdrive, hunt for other tributes. Double Jeopardy discovers a river. Bombshell practices his archery. I think this isn't the time to be practicing. <laughs> yeah, you should have already done that. <laughs> should be too. Yeah, yeah. Also, what the... Wouldn't have been more fitting if it was Double Jeopardy that was practicing archery. And Bombshell finding the river because of boat mode. Monsoon <laughs> chases Bronco. That's really kind of accurate considering that Toro spent the majority of his fight against Fridby Ultimate running away from him. <laughs> Makes sense, yeah. <laughs> when they have the chance, they run. Kilohertz tends to wipe out its wounds. Oh my god, the yeah. romance is starting. Did he use the those knives that he found? The romance is starting, indeed. I mean, I he guess did. you could use knives. <laughs> Kinda. I, I wouldn't trust it though. Like heat it and sear the wound or something? Minotaur scares I-Beam off, that's accurate. Is how Minotaur scared of I-Beam? <laughs> Just the death hog. The death hog. And Hydra travels a higher ground. It's the Radican! I have the Hydra! <laughs> <laughs> Son of a bitch. Five cannon shots, I don't remember five. Tantrum, District 4. Sub-Zero, District 4. Oh, they're already wiped out. Gollum, District 5. Brutus, District 10. And Biohazard. Okay, I do remember 5 now. Deputy gonna fire off for all five of them. He can only fire off for two. He fires off for Tantrum and Sub-Zero and goes, eh, fuck the other one. Yeah. <laughs> they're not important. Night 1. Bronco stays awake all night, fearing bite forces around the corner. Where's my horse? Where is he? Where is he? The third one. Wait. Wait. What's that? The third one. <laughs> Killer B convinces X backwards to snuggle with him. Wait a second. Oh, like, wasn't Hexy D and like four others all like going around hunting other people, and now it's cheerfully singing songs? <laughs> Go oh, by all my lord. It Clearly is not my lord. No, no, wait. Considering this is Battlebots Reborn, he's probably seeing uh, Spin Me Right Round, right? <laughs> yeah. yeah! Or if it's, if it's one of the older videos, it's Let me lick you up and down. <laughs> oh, God! <laughs> <laughs> I beam sublays and gruff sleep in shifts. Lucky is awoken by nightmares. Nightmares? Oh my god, or oh nightmares. my god. Multiple nightmares. nightmares. Nightmare, backlash, and all of their friends. Multiple nightmares. Nightmare, backlash, backlash, locust. Backlash and nightmare, yeah. Hydra is unable to start a fire. It doesn't have a flamethrower. It makes sense, makes sense. Bombshell sees a fire but stays hidden. The corpse, it could be the corpse of Biohazard when Bruce has fell on him. <laughs> Bite Force He's begs for Monsoon to kill him. He refuses keeping Bite Force alive. Shouldn't it be the other way around because of season four? Yeah, you'd Maybe. think. Later. Blacksmith, Lockjaw, Minotaur, and Wipeout tell each other ghost stories to lighten the moon. Oh. <laughs> Overdrive accidentally steps on the landmine. <laughs> 
Ooh, what a way to go. I mean, Jesus. Day two, X backwards scares Lockjaw off. Oh my, he got his revenge. <laughs> <My vengeance. laughs> I'm just wet one underneath. I'm just wet one underneath. Bronco silently <laughs> snaps Bite Force's neck. Down he goes. Bronco oh, got his revenge. Yes, he did. Oh, it. Episode two, revenge. Oh, <laughs> silently too. So does he silently sneak up on him, and then the snapping of the neck is also silent? No, no. See, his, his flippers are retracting, so it doesn't make any noise, so he just clamps Viper's face with this flipper that's retracting. Oh, okay, that makes sense, that makes sense. Okay, Sawblaze receives an explosive from an unknown sponsor. Again, very poor choice from the sponsors. <laughs> <laughs> very poor. Hey, both of them, both of them hey. with flame have fucking explosive. What pyromaniac thought this was a good idea? You know what? I'd rather be Sawblade than Blacksmith with the explosives, because, you know. But are you not entertained? I am a little entertained. Yes, I am! Kilohertz practices his archery. Ruff injures himself! Die. How? Is this he drew cool ground he a biohazard, and then he hit the still-spinning weapon of Brutus. <laughs> no, it was still going. <laughs> Post-mortem. Lucky receives clean water from an unknown sponsor. Now he's got food and water. He's set. Who, who, who's wasting our money on? Who's wasting our money on Lucky? It might not be a waste if he wins. Yes. He's not gonna win. <laughs> it's Lucky. Killer B tries Lucky to spear guys. fish with a trident. Is he using the middleweight robot trident? <laughs> <laughs> or excuse me, it's excuse me, it's pronounced trident. He's not trident. He's using the Robot Wars series free competitor trident. Hydra unknowingly eats toxic berries. <laughs> He hasn't died yet. He hasn't died. I think he yet. dies from that. I think that's death. I, yeah, yeah, otherwise it wouldn't have specified toxic berries. Hexy D fishes. Wipeout receives clean water from an unknown sponsor. Blacksmith, Bombshell, Minotaur, and Monsoon hunt for other tributes. You yeah. have you have you have all the powerhouses and then Blacksmith. I think he meant to say all the powerhouses and then Bombshell. No no no, Bombshell is a powerhouse. It got to the grand final and it beat Tombstone. I think you're. I think what you really meant was all, all the powerhouses. And they want to rumble. And <laughs> I think what you really meant is you have all the powerhouses and then Minotaur. We might as well single out every bot. I beam collects fruit from a tree. Dude, that's a spin in a circle and whack, whack. Yeah, just smack it back and forth. Double Jeopardy searches for a water source. But he found a river. <laughs> that's <laughs> that's that. How stupid are like, you? How is a river not a source of water? Hold on, hold on. Medicine, mm. I don't know what he's doing. Because he's run out of bullets, he's turning his gun, his cannon, into a water cannon. Yeah! Smart man! Smart man! Three cannon shots from District 2, Overdrive, from District 1, By Force, and District 6, Hydra. Only the unimportant people. Continue. Sawblaze tends to Minotaur's wounds. Kilohertz sees fire but stays hidden. Biohazard is still on fire. We don't know how or why, but he's still on fire. The most ultimate battle. Bombshell strangles Blacksmith after engaging in a fistfight. I beam destroy destroys Gruff's supplies while he is sleeping. Why not just kill him? Why just destroy Gruff? Why not just go after him? <laughs> I beam doesn't I think. Why? No, no. He had so many I options. He could have. He could have. He could have killed Gruff. He could have taken the stuff. No, he just burned it. <laughs> yeah. Bronco receives a hatchet from an unknown sponsor. Lucky destroys wipeout supplies while he's asleep. Why do you think? Kill them. Oh my god. Kill each other. <laughs> this is my. Nick, this is my strategy, okay, see? I'm, I'm gonna destroy Matt's supplies, so that way he can't do anything to me. That's the thing, that's my beauty tactic right here. Or you could kill him and take his supplies! X backwards, oh, Spears yeah. Monsoon in the abdomen. Oh, Lockjaw, Killer B, and Double Jeopardy sleep in shifts. What a team. <laughs> Hexy D attempts to start a, a fire, but it's unsuccessful. No one it's a it's flipper! He can't start a fire regardless. He's gonna flip oh, shit when he doesn't start that fire. Day three. I-Beam defeats Lockjaw in a fight, but spares his life. <laughs> I-Beam is on a mad one. Lucky constructs a shack. Bronco, Gruff, and Wipeout hunt for other tributes. Kilohertz tends to Minotaur's wounds. Oh my god, so many relationships are starting to form in this. Oh, it's so romantic. Kilohertz oh. is such a nice... <laughs> Kil Kilohertz is a whore! That's a second time! It's <laughs> <laughs> a goddamn <laughs> whore! He's a Just fuck already! <laughs> <laughs> yes. Just put it in. I guess you could say. 
Oh I guess you could play Killer Hertz as a Killer Horse. Oh my God! Kill a horse. Oh my God! Hey, kill a, hey you, oh know what, God. you know what? Killer Hertz. Killer Hertz. You should do it already because you got the longest shaft of them all. <laughs> Killer Hertz. Oh my God! Killer Hertz. Oh my God! Stick it in my drum. Oh my God! <laughs> We're, we're jam up Minotaur good. I don't, I don't like what Tom's I mean, doing. We're gonna move on. If Killer Minotaur did have a baby, would the baby be British or Brazilian? Um, Brazilian. It would have, it would have the ass of a Brazilian, but the attitude of an Englishman. XED sees smoke rising in the distance, but decides not to investigate. How is Biohazard still on fire? Jesus Christ! <laughs> so maybe they really started to on smoke. Don't worry no, about. No, here's what's happening. Biohazard is actually. Biohazard is playing the long con. He's just he's just hiding under Brutus's corpse. So he's actually gonna win the whole game. <laughs> Smart. <laughs> he's playing the long con, boys. Hey, Rich, are you ready? For what? Look at the next one, Nick. It's X backwards travels to higher ground. I want to I have the high ground. You underestimate my power. I'm try it. You were the chosen one. <laughs> I was begging you to destroy the Sith, not join them! Oh my god. Bring balance to the Force, not leave it in darkness! <laughs> Nick, move on, you like, my on. We're, we're gonna, we're, yeah, He's I'm memorized not. this whole thing, hasn't he? Bombshell tries to spear fish with a trident. To be fair, that does seem like a, a weapon configuration bombshell. Probably. <laughs> yeah. Double Jeopardy tries to spear fish with a trident. Sawblaze attempts to climb a tree, but falls to his death. And the no one's there, there, there for him to land on to take. Yeah, to take with him. Killer B hunts for other tributes. Three cannon shots can be heard in the distance. From District 1, Blacksmith. From District 2, Monsoon. And from District 9, Sawblaze. Killer B is awoken by nightmares on night three. All right, double jeopardy passes out from exhaustion. Lucky looks at the night sky. He spent all his time finding a water source. How did... Uh, <laughs> he had the water source, forgot the about, about it, and then passed it out. It says, it says exhaustion, not dehydration. I guess. So technically, he's still alive. I think, yeah. He's just, you know, passed out. But vulnerable. Wipeout catches Bronco off guard and kills him! Uh, this is our fighting for you, bitch! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, Rich, you're becoming aggressive. Are you turning into me? I'm not sure how Wipeout would ever catch anyone off guard, <laughs> considering it can't move unless it's... Hey, he's slow moving, okay? He's got the ability of stealth. Yeah, but you're hearing this constant wow. I was gonna say, he's so fucking loud. <laughs> I beam, Hexy D, Gruff, and X backwards sleep and shifts. When I see four bots, I think it's gonna be entertaining. The, the dream team right there. <laughs> That's your final four of Metabots Revoir Cup, and I beam beats the rest. Minotaur and Lockjaw hold hands. Oh my god, it's so romantic. <laughs> <laughs> so Minotaur is, uh. Left kilohertz, I guess. Yeah. So now Minotaur yeah. cheating on kilohertz, and kilohertz can go back to wipeout. Bombshell convinces kilohertz to snuggle with him, <laughs> and kilohertz is at it again. No, Bombshell, dude, you're gonna get the shot. <laughs> Somebody come and get her. She's dancing like a stripper. <laughs> Oh Bring my god. He's <laughs> a well known nymphomaniac. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm Kilohertz. I'm 18. And I like to fuck. I like to look at WhatsApp and Tinder and fuck a guy and yeah. <laughs> my favorite position's the pile driver. In a loop all drag race. Oh my god. No, I mean, day, no, day four. No. Day four. I mean, injures himself. Oh no. no oh, what no. a legend. What a legend. I hope it's not fatal. Lucky hunts for other tributes. X backwards camouflages himself in the bushes. Oh my god, is Wipeout gonna get killed? Oh no. I can, I can yes. see him. No. At least somebody gets killed. He works together with Bombshell. No! no. Ah. Ah. no. <laughs> I like how disappointed <laughs> Bombshell knows his place. Yeah. Double Jeopardy begs for Kilohertz to kill him. He reluctantly obliges, killing Double Jeopardy. So, hold on. Double Jeopardy asked to kill, for Kilohertz to kill him. Yeah. Basically what happened is that Double Jeopardy realized that his cannon was useless. He already shot off his two weapons, he uses a water cannon, he uses a tether, he's tried he it. has nothing left. He's tried everything and he's gone, oh god, I've, I've run out of things now <laughs> to do. Um, Kilohertz, hi, um, can you do me a solos here and just, you know, just stab your axe in my um, pneumatics please? Just, just right in there. He couldn't find the water and he got desperate. So wait, so that means instead of Kilohertz saying what he did, it's just... Uh, I'm Kilohertz. I'm 18. And I like big ass. Now I've got to now I've got to draw the minutes of the fat Brazilian ass now, haven't I? <laughs> yes. I've now got to do it. Yeah, you have yeah, to do you it. Do. Oh. 
heard it here first, guys. I have to now draw B- Minotaur as a hot Brazilian chick. There we go. And if you want your own poster Ooh. of that, Dom is taking commissions. Lockjaw receives an explosive from an unknown sponsor. He catches fire every fight. This sounds like a terrible idea. This could only go one way. Terrible. Lockjaw, Lockjaw is a chain smoker. This is a bad <laughs> idea. <laughs> Minotaur receives an explosive from an unknown sponsor. Gruff overhears Killer B and Hexy D talking in the distance. What the hell could they do? What are they talking about? So um, you know, you know, I Beam, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah? Um, he he um he had opportunities to um kill both Lucky and Bite Force originally before Bite Force died. Yeah. What a dumbass. If I know, right? He's never gonna win the Battle Boss Reborn Hunger Games. We have. Arena event: A swarm of tracker jackers invades the area. Crackers. Oh God! Lucky knocks Bombshell unconscious and leaves him there as bait. <laughs> <laughs> tracker jackers. Tracker jackers. Tracker jackers. Yeah. Sure, has a battle. That could be a great battle bot's name. Jesus. In the red tracker. square. <laughs> I mean, survives. Kilohertz survives. It actually just. It's actually just the swarm of my Why I mean, has why why spin and plays. Wipe out ties. Wipe out. It's stung to death! Oh, oh, he was too slow. Ooh. Minotaur is stung to death. And it's my only other... Both me and Matt's bots are dead, but I've still got my prediction in there, so... <laughs> I'm staying in there, boys. I'm staying in there. Uh-oh. Gruff knocks XCD unconscious and leaves him there as bait. Wait, hold on. Gruff saw them t- heard them talking shit about I-Beam, and then... That's you know, what you get to I'm talking shit about I-Beam, motherfucker. Yeah, I'm not tolerating it. I'm only gonna kill one of them. Killer B survives! <laughs> Let's go, Killer B. Now. Uh oh. Now. I think Axe Backwards dies here. While running away from the Tracker Jackers, Blackjaw grabs Axe Backwards and throws him to the ground. That might be death. Let's see. Let's see our cannon shots. Seven. So we lost Bronco, Double Jeopardy, Bombshell, Wipeout, Minotaur, Hexy D. X backwards. Let's take a look at the status real quick. All right. Let's see who's alive. So Killer so, B is alive. We... Killer Hurts. I Beam. Gruff. Lucky. Lockjaw. So we got six. I Beam's the only one that didn't score a kill because he is a dumbass. <laughs> he decided to go for. Every, he decided to go for everyone. He's playing pacifist. Ratchet. He's playing pacifist. <laughs> <laughs> I don't believe in fighting. This is the pacifist run for I Beam, boys. The pacifist run for I Beam. Night four. Everyone except Killer B sleeps, and Killer B passes out because he didn't sleep. I was, I was getting so, I was getting so happy that I thought Killer B had died. <laughs> I was so happy. I was, you could hear the shock in my eyes and my face. Yeah, you could hear the shock in my eyes. I'm glad he realized it because I was about to say something. something. The cornucopia is replenished with food supplies, weapon, and memoirs. Lockjaw decides not to go. Killer B. Yeah. <laughs> don't read ahead. Lucky and I Beam get into a fight over raw meat, but I Beam gives up and runs away. And then Killer B, Killer Hurts, and Gruff get into a fight. Killer B triumphantly kills them both. Yes! Oh so you've got a what a mad man. <laughs> what a mad oh, man. And this, and this right here, ladies and gentlemen, proved that wedges will always ring supreme. Q, Q, now Q, got <laughs> four predictions left. Q Nate from Bunglebots. Wedge. Wedge. Here we go. Prediction number Day two. Day five. I- Ivy oh, collects fruit. That. And Lockjaw is pricked by thorns while pricking berries. Killer B dies from hunger! No! No! <laughs> no! Get out of here! But he was at no! the feast! Come on, I beam. No! Come on, I beam. I might have lost my money on uh, Wipeout, but uh. Go, I beam! Go, I beam! And Lockjaw's turn. Okay, come Lockjaw on. fishes. Oh, <laughs> that was anticlimactic. So anticlimactic. <laughs> We're down to three. As I'm sure we're gonna get, yep, three more cannon shots. There goes another three names. I love how, like, Killer Bee killed both of them and then just died from hunger. Yeah. Good job. <laughs> he spent all of his energy trying also, to get. He was the how did he die from hunger after a. T- I have no idea. Night five. Oh, Lucky is awoken oh, by no. nightmares and Lockjaw kills I Beam with a sickle. No. I Beam. He was a power of communism. On, he was a communist. Uh, that's what you get for being a dumbass, I beam. Logjaw was a commie the whole time. Unbelievable. Sorry. No, I beam ends, oh, ends, ends the game with uh, no, the final kill. No, the final kill is Lucky and Lockjaw. It's our desperado fight. Really Canadian win. All right, oh boys. Wait, hold on, hold on. All right, listen. Hold on. The can- Guys, hold on a second. Hold on a second. Okay. Lucky and Lockjaw were teammates. 
They were! District 12! This is the greatest war in the history of the Soviet Union versus the Canadian. <laughs> Matt, who are you supporting? Go! Lucky. Who do you think I'm supporting? <laughs> Alright, ready guys? Let's do it! Come on! Come on, Lucky! Proceed. Come on! Lucky, Lucky shoots a poisonous oh, yellow dart into... Uh, oh, Lucky goes down! Wait, wait, Everybody pause, uh, remember, remember. Remember, remember, Biohazard's still alive, he's playing the long con, boys. <laughs> he's still in it. I was so Two cannon close. shots. So <laughs> Two cannon shots, which means... Fuck Joe wins! Yay! Yay! Congratulations, nobody wanted you to win. Proceed now for the final kill count. You made me lose my position. Now, now, now everybody... Uh, in the comments, who would actually win though in a real battle royale between these like between, 24 yeah, people? between these 24? That is the good question. Well, Tantrum can't handle it mentally, so let's actually say it's tw between 23 bots. Leave your comments down below and we will check them out and like them all. And we will, I promise you that. That is correct. Maybe. If you say it sounds like you're making channel, pro your mouth's making promises, uh, body can't keep. <laughs> hey, you don't know. So, thank you guys for watching, everybody. Hopefully, you enjoyed this. Make sure um, to check everyone out here in the description that has a channel and actually posts regularly. I'm looking at you, Dom. Dom. Yeah, I make content. <laughs> and make sure to subscribe to this channel. Hit the bell for notifications. BattleBots Reborn Cup Season 5 will start Monday, May 11th. Make sure you're there for the live stream because I will be there in the comments, probably with some of these guys as well. Thank you for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Goodbye. Bye. Uh Smash that yeah. like button with your forehead.